This is an oscilloscope that was made in the 1960s, and the nice thing about it is that it has both vertical and horizontal inputs. And so I've been uh, putting in audio signals with the left channel and right channel hooked up to the X and Y axes, and found that a lot of uh, music looks pretty interesting on here. Usually with uh, fewer instruments it looks better. Here's some organ music. A lot of these music uh, files will uh, make some interesting 3D shapes. And sometimes they even look like they're kind of rotating around in 3D. Which is, of course, just something our brain is interpreting. But I was curious as to why this happens, so I made some waveforms on my computer and put them in. And I found out uh, a little bit about what causes the uh, more interesting shapes. With a sine wave on one channel, you can get either a vertical or horizontal line. So this is a relatively low frequency. Now if I add a another sine wave on the other channel that's 90 degrees out of phase then you can get a circle and make sure the volumes are balanced there we go um, but things get more interesting when we add harmonics so here's one that is uh, one and a half times the frequency of that circle so we get kind of a standing wave there and uh, it's even more interesting if we add something that's almost a harmonic. So this is not quite one and a half times the frequency. And then I can uh, add that higher frequency in both channels. And we get like a star shape. So now if I change the volume of the lower frequency in just one of the channels, I can get it to rotate in the kind of the um, Z direction facing the camera. So it looks like we're just looking at it from a different perspective. Oh yeah, that's kind of cool. <laughs> so there I, I kept in the uh, the actual one and a half times frequency along with the the, the ones that are almost one and a half times. I like that one. Now if we add a even higher frequency we can get kind of a little ripply thing there. frequency this is, but it makes it look like a little starfish. There's just a little starfish floating in the water there. And here's the actual second harmonic, almost the second harmonic that is.
But suffice it to say, you could entertain yourself for that for hours with this. Here's one of my favorite songs to watch on here. <laughs> 